here, Power Forward from the University of Miami. I wouldn't say growing up in Nicaragua was difficult. I would say it was different, totally different from the US. I'm a really big family guy. But I get introduced in sports. When I was younger, it was because of my dad. I think I was five years old. My dad would take me up like at 6 a.m. and we would go on the baseball field that was nearest to our house. Actually, that's the sport my dad wanted me to play baseball. He's like crazy in love with baseball. He actually played baseball. The first time I actually like thought about playing basketball, the Bluefield Academy, coach Ronnie Cayazzo. He said, oh, you're a pretty good baseball player and you're pretty tall too. I run a basketball academy here in, in Bluefields. I would like to know if you want to play for me. He went to my house, he talked with my dad and like, that's how I get introduced to basketball. <laughs> Arkansas State was just great. One of the coaches that helped me a lot at Arkansas State, his name is Brent Cruz. He would spend endless nights working out, trying to you know, develop my craft. That's the memories I just, I just love from Arkansas State. It's like that, Let's go. So when I think about how I'm the first nigga I went to play D1 basketball, it feels great, you know? My real goal is just getting better, better, and try to go to the league. So like, I try to don't take my focus off that. Bring the funk back. When we first heard about Norshad, uh, it was because he put his name in the transfer portal. And then everybody we spoke to just raved about the young man. We looked up all of his stats, we watched his videos, and my coaching staff and I were totally sold on Norshad and we immediately made him a high priority in our recruiting and we're very, very fortunate that he committed to us. I think what makes Miami such a good fit for transfers is the coaching staff and the way that they build the culture. Um, obviously the players too, but I think Coach L's success he's had in the past and you know his knowledge and wisdom, I think that's what makes Miami such a, a good transfer spot. I knew this is a place I was interested in going as well. Um, so obviously I, I did my research on North Chat, um, looked up his highlights, you know, his, his stats and things like that, seeing how, you know, Donovan the player he was um, at his previous school. Um, I was like, man, if we could get him um, to come here and if I came there as well, I feel like that would be a really good pickup for the transfer portal. He needs to play football. This is the wrong sport. This is the wrong sport. That ain't my sport. Ray Lewis. How you pronounce this? Selva Negra. Selva Negra. That was yeah, good? That was perfect. <laughs> this is good food here now. What, what would you get normally? Well, you see, we eat a lot of meat in Nicaragua. So, like, we eat carne asada for appetizer, but also for the... For the entree? Yeah. <laughs> Any, like, eating customs in Nicaragua? So, you see, normally, the appetizers, we just, how they are like little pieces of uh, fried cheese mm -hmm. or meat, we just eat them with our hands. Okay. Like we really don't use forks or stuff. Like for the real food, for the injury, that's when we use forks and stuff. And stuff like that. And for the appetizer, we really don't use that. Word, word, that's dope. That's how I be at home, so. <laughs> At the games, you know what I mean? I always see the Nicaraguan flag, um, people going crazy, the support you taking photos after the games. Like, how does that feel? Because I mean, I've never got to experience, you know, coming to the States and having people, you know, represent my home flag. So how does that feel for you? It's just amazing. You know that I have so much support from not just Nicaraguans, but also my Latino friends, you know? Yeah. My Latino countries, that like, everybody reach out. It just feels good. You know, but it also give me a great responsibility to do stuff right, you know, don't mess up, show the kids, you know, the right way. You know, that 
stuff can happen if you work for it and you know you do the right things. I would say North Chad, the basketball player, is a difference maker for this team. As Coach L says, we're playing, you know, small ball this year. And with him, you know, playing way bigger than what he is, um, grabbing, you know, 10 plus rebounds a game and getting two, three blocks a game. He's 6'7", 245 pounds of dynamite. And he goes after every ball, offensively and defensively. And because he is focused on that skill set, he's one of the best, if not the best, rebounder at both ends of the court that I've ever coached. Nurse of the Mere loves doing the dirty work. So like, I love playing defense. I love, you know, setting hard screens, like, you know, fighting for rebounds, you know, diving to the ground. I love doing the dirty work. All it takes is one guy to, you know, be hyped up before a game or during the game. And, it, you know, the team feeds off of it or we bring our energy up. I think North Chad's been our main catalyst of, you know, bringing our energy up, getting us hyped up. Miami, I think it, this is the best city to live in the U.S. You know, I've been to a lot of places. I, I visit a lot of places and you know, nowhere like Miami. I would probably be in Nicaragua right now. Like, I would probably go back home. But, you know, being in Miami, you know, I have home food here. I, ha I know a lot of people. I have family here. It's always good to have the support from people you know, people from back home, let alone his own country. So I think, you know, it's huge for him. It, it lifts his spirits. It gets him excited to play. If I wouldn't be a dreamer, I would not be here today. You know, and I just, like, I told, I told the guys, like, almost every day, like, we're going to go for the national championship. Like, we can't expect nothing less. We got to look at the big, the big boy, you know. We can't, we got to go for it and, you know, work. That's the goal and nothing less. Everybody feel it come around with the rhythm, it's a sound. Everybody get down when we give it to you. Everybody feel it come around with the rhythm, it's a sound. Everybody get down, down, give it to you. Everybody feel it come around with the rhythm, rhythm. Everybody feel it come around.